were waiting, waiting for this time off, waiting for a break from your lives and from your jobs. But now in the wake of a new day, it's not what you thought. You've been given all the time that you need and somehow you're lost. Understand the cost of what it means for every human being. There are certain kinds of people that need others to believe that their lives have any meaning and their feelings are received. This is hell on earth for some while others expect them to be freed. For you to do what you were wishing you've only had time to do. For you to learn and grow and create the ways you've always wanted to. For you to catch a point you know you're only eventually getting to. But by vacating with no deadline, you're all just waiting for things to move and it's not you, just a truth that they're forcing to subdue. Rather than facing it and changing what we're all now going through, you should be embracing every moment of this could be opportune, but you're just wasting it away. How many chances can we lose? You were told that outside is a hazard, and to go there you're adding to this disaster. While you were waiting for something to happen, Anything active Just wanted your jobs back You were told That connection's a hazard And to seek it you're adding To this disaster While you were aching For something to happen While you were actually granted Back your family and friends You were waiting Waiting for a change of pace, waiting for a day or just an hour that you could get away. But now with months of only relaxation and much needed space, you all just want back to the lies that you created. Now even if you hate them, because the solitude has been driving you insane. FaceTime every single day, but you all know it's not the same. Shirt and shoes have become masks and gloves at every store and place. You're not allowed inside this building unless we cannot see your face. It's a shame you're forced to stay with nobody to blame. Your anger has no outlet. You are filling up with rage. With no definitive end in sight, you cannot plan your future days. Time is money, but all this wealth doesn't accommodate a cage. You just wait day by day while entire nations are praying. Families are getting smaller. They're dying at such a rate. Denial is on the rise, facing a possible fate. We may have to accept the fact that history has permanently changed. You're all waiting for something to happen. No one wants to imagine if it never goes back. And your children will grow up and prison. What you wanted to give them are no things of the past. You ignore what you could be giving. You are no longer living, only standing in place. But tell me what's going to happen when you can no longer manage, and it's more dangerous to stay. You've been waiting, waiting for your chance to leave, waiting for them to say that it's okay, and you can finally go back to what it was you were doing before all was made to freeze, but now that it's approaching, nobody's minds are put at ease. What does this even mean? That you can just go back out on the streets like this didn't even happen, and now suddenly you're free. What about all the people that still don't trust the air that they will breathe? No matter what you're told, you know that nothing's really guaranteed. And what do you even believe? Do you think it's all a scheme? When they blurred that line so many times, what's real versus what you see? Was this carried over by mistake or weaponized disease? When in fact you'll never really know, and still wouldn't change a thing. But do you really think it's over and you can go? How could it be? Because we're beginning to get annoyed with all the media we've seen. How convenient we're all distracted by a sudden change in story. No justice, no peace. R.I.P. George Floyd.